I was just showing Tabs my new purchase, boys, look. My new park light one. I just say, Tabs, what's this little clip thing here? It says, look, so you can undo it, look. Look, they hook it. Quite good, I thought. Oh, how much is this? What, about 15 quid or something? But what's really good, what I liked about it, what really sold it for me, is it's got a USB output so I can charge my phone off it because this charger in my van is fucked, isn't it? So I can charge my phone off my light. Plus it's really big, so I'm not going to lose it, I'm hoping. Tabs reckons I need a Makita charger instead, don't you, Tabs? What's that, is that one? That's got a torch in it, look, and all. Is that a USB one as well, and a torch? Oh, how much that'll be good, well, like 20 quid, look. So then I can lose the torch, the USB thing, and the battery. And your phone, all at all, the same Yeah, all at the same time, can't I? Cush the little do. Can't wait to get one. So I can leave it on the chassis somewhere. Quite that's, that's what you want. Honestly, Mosh, before oh, I go night fishing, I only take one Makita battery with me. You're, you're, you're on five amp power, though, ain't you? Yeah, what are you on, fours? I've got, yeah, threes and... Uh, I've got one five amp power, in fact. I don't know, I need to sort my batteries out much, because some of them it won't charge. So there, Tabs. Let's go do some running rounds, some inspections, boys. I'm having, as well, problems with this fucking P38. I took it for test, well, pre-test last week. I was going to take it for test, but then when I got to the testing station, it says, well, let me just have a look round it. And anyway, on the way to testing station, went down a long straight, obviously I've never been down a real long straight road, and it got into about third gear and won't go any higher and it's going fucking revving its tits off at 50 mile an hour, not changing up a gear. So that to me is a massive fucking headache because I thought the gearbox was all all right on that and now it turns out it's up shit creek. And I've got a month to go before this fucking skin flint challenge and now I've got gearbox problems. And the front near side wheel is like that because the two ball joints top and bottom are absolutely fucked which I'm not worried about. I can buy new ball joints and fit that. It's just this gearbox problem what I'm bothered about. If anyone has any ideas of what that is, please let me know in the comments because I'm struggling. I've been on the Google. I've been on all these freaking thingies. I can't find that piss all. So if you've got any ideas, put them in the comments because I am struggling on that one. Me and Aiden's going to tackle it at the weekend. So I want some ideas before the weekend, boys. Come on, let's get to work. That's just cost me 60 quid lot for a new multimeter. My multimeter fucked. Tried me, because you guys says, didn't you? I had to test, see what's draining your battery. Uh, use your multimeter and put it on it. But of course, went to use my multimeter. That's bollocks. Oh, best connect my battery up, Anna. That's the way forward. Did it disconnect to your battery every time you get out? Right, forwards we go! Classic. Got a little crane to take off now, that's in no use. Are you got any silicon or what? Got any what? Silicon. Just stick that crane. I don't want more. Right, Joe, there's a way of doing this. Yeah, look, you see that? That's bunged up lot, so you just stab it like that. And there's your silicone hole. Oh, that. Oh, she ain't in here. <laughs> <laughs> well, you wanted silicon. I gave you silicon. Right, I've got to take this crane off. Needs a new drag link on it. Here, look, I'll show you. Not playing it, you see, so it needs a new drag link. I'm just going to get a drag link hole complete bar. 
because I like spending money like that. You know why? Because it's just fucking, fucking hell. Because some of this age, it's just not worth just buying the end. Because that end will be no doubt a tart as hell in the bar. You end up fucking around waiting for that long. It's going to cost more money for me to try to buy it than it is just putting a new bar on it. So I'm just going to order a whole complete drag link bar. Alright, do you know what I was going to Right, to the next job. For the makeup through the fall. Working for that dog. What? I'm going past it. I'm going past the Greg's. Coming around the river banker, the old train was so sane. The very next thing you hear from me, I've been tied to a ball and chain. That river there we've just gone on right at Claypole, I remember as a kid, they used to have once a year, they used to have raft racing on. Where all the adults and that. Uh, used to make a raft, like a homemade raft, and have a theme to it, like pirates or whatever. Uh, and they all used to sail it from one bit of the stream down to the other bit of the stream, like a raft race. But it wasn't really a race, it was more of just a laugh, obviously. But there used to be hundreds of us there with the crowds, obviously, with the kids and that watching them. Uh, but they don't do it anymore, obviously, health and safety have put a stop to that, haven't they? You can't have any fun like that again, can you? Because what about if you fall off the raft and fucking drown? It's too dangerous. So they don't have that anymore now. But it was good though, I always remember watching it as a kid thinking, oh, that's amazing, can't wait till I get older and I can do that. Now they probably stopped to it before I was old enough. Sick man. Good time, boys, listen to my song. May not go better. I bet the breathe is bonged. Oh, it's not. No. I thought it might be bonged, but it's not. She wants a hub seal on then, doesn't she? Tastes like diff oil, that does, for some reason. I wonder why, Chris, I wonder why. Village. I couldn't find the side light views. I'll show you where it is, look. You see that eye there? That's for the near side, the other eye is for the offside. It's I for idiot, for blowing fuses. There it is. Let's see if they work now. Oh, wonderful, darling, wonderful. I'd get a real hook seal for that one, eh? Boys, I've just set up a post office box. 
because Diesel Hat said last week, he said, uh, Chris, set up a post office box and I'll fucking send you a plastic hammer through the post. We've got loads of them here. So I've just looked in the Royal Mail and I thought, it's £36 a month, right, or 300 and something a year. But I thought, fuck it, I may as well do the cunt, can Because if, if, if you guys were to send me any shit, obviously, like a torture or like that, I'll save fucking £36 on a torch, won't I? Even that hammer, you see, I'll save the fucking th uh, £36 on that hammer. So let's give it a go, eh? Out for note, boys, out for note. But it takes seven days to go uh, for it to register or something. But I've applied and paid for it now, so I've named it the Struggler's Post Box. You know what I'm saying, boys. Send your freebies my way, I'll have them. Open out, boys, open out. One man's shit is another man's gold. Right, to the next job. I've done that job, you see? Post office box. Don't think I'm not modernised now, is it? I did it all on my phone. I'm very proud of myself for doing that as well. I'll no doubt done something wrong, but still. It's all seemed to go through, okay? With the Royal Mail, it was. So when it's through, I'll put a link in the description thing to my post office box. Don't send me a load of fucking ramble through. <laughs> I can imagine what I'm going to get through that post office box. Okay, now look at that lot. Some bastard sent me a dead pigeon. <laughs> Classic. Right, to the next inspection, boys. Let's go. Enough twatting about on the computer. The rain's coming. I do like Belton. It is a very picturesque village. If Carlsberg did villages, they'd be like Belton. And you've got Belton House there. That's got the indoor outdoor play area. You can walk around the grounds with the kids. Cushy little do. Lovely picturesque little village. Right, let's, let's go disco. Not much wrong with that. That's pretty good, that one. A bit of corrosion on exhaust brackets and fuel tanks and all that lot. Needs a few wiper blades, but nothing serious, boys. Let's go to Scottish Yard. Got a breakdown on one of his magnet things or something. I don't know. Let's go see how Scott does. Yeah, I started watching a series uh, last night on Netflix, uh, which is very rare for me, because normally I ain't got a chance. Uh, what was it? The Lincoln Lawyer. Yeah, The Lincoln Lawyer. Because he drives a Lincoln. It's quite good, I quite like it. It's not bad. I watched the first two anyway. And I'm still enjoying it, so it must have, must have been that bad. I do like a good series. I like a good film, really, but I haven't really seen much of good art lately. You see no good art lately, film-wise, boys. I mind to watch a nice, good film. I saw one advertised with Mark Wahlberg. What was that? He was like, what was he? Oh, it's coming soon, it is. He, like, turns into a priest, he looks of it, which looks quite good on an advert. On an advert. One more one. You know where they load the one they load into. Yeah, alright. Well the first one? Yeah. Why is it the magnet? Yeah. Let's see what we've got on this one then boys. This is hinged on here, and it's putting pressure on there, up against there. So he's going to get the telehandler and push that away, and then that will come out there. Because really, this needs a bracket on it here, look. Right, 
Right, they're really pushing from the middle, but we come up your place. Push to this angle, right in the middle there, look. I thought it was dense as well, bro. Yeah, if you got some, yeah. Yeah, do that, bro. Just push that thing. Hey, it's got its own woodruff key built into there, look. Yeah. Let me get that. Hey, at least we're a bit wiser though, Christoph, aren't we? Give a piece of myself to the page, I don't do it for the praise, love. That's just how I'm made. Yeah. the glass in the mirror. Yeah. Do it at me, old man, trying to pass in the fear. You're the first one to talk, but the last one to hear. Eyes blurry, but I couldn't see the ass and he cleared down. Start to feel like I'm on one. Start to land, I'll be here for the long run. I'm a slave for the cash, got snakes in the grass, no brakes on the head, but it's all fun. We done seen it all, heard it all, heard enough, give me space for I murder y'all. Ten bad bitches here, I'ma curve them all, twelve missed calls, and I still made a curtain call. Here to light it up, lighten up, hear him talking. That's not it today, Christoph, is it? Huh? No. That's nah, alright, isn't it? Look at that, that's beautiful. Oh, that bit of a bracketing skill from me and Christoph. Fucking teamwork makes the dream work. because if it was rigid it would just break itself apart it's got to have a bit of play in it and we put that plate around it just hold it on what had happened is it had not known to support it and all it's done is wriggled itself off and then snapped that fucking woodruff key right at the tip of the woodruff key so all we did is basically push it back on and fucking put that bracing bracket around it she'll be sweet i've had the battery disconnected let's see if she starts Yeah, perfect now, nah, look, what's the crack? One minute is dead as a dodo, next minute she's fucking lively. Weird. Good old struggle, boss. <laughs> Train line time. Oh yeah. 